yet again. I took a cheap little diamond painting to work today and I went into a conference room at lunch and did a little painting. It was so cool because Um, well, it's like 22 colors or something, but um, it So this is it right here. I don't know how well you can see with the glare, but it's 22 colors and I got that done today. You can see that. Got that done today up there in that corner. <laughs> but um, I had gotten these little um, things at AliExpress and I didn't know what I was going to use them for because they're so tiny but they're perfect for this project and so like this is 16 of course it's backwards for you guys but this is 16 little things that pop off the lids and they snap down in place and they're great and then I have some bags for in case I got any overflow I can put the I put my little um, my little labels and and then I just took a, just a regular, just a pink, and then the normal little green tray. But it was fun. And so now I'll have one always with me. Maybe you can see it better now. It's little stairs up into the wooded area, into like flowers and stuff. It doesn't have a little, um, it doesn't have a little uh, thumbnail to look at, but the campus was in pretty good shape. It doesn't have a lot of, you know, it has just the little folds in it, but not really. I got it for like $2.50 on Amazon, and I think I bought five little kits on Amazon and so I got this one I got a couple of little partials and they were cute uh, one's a little kitty cat in a mug just adorable and then one was a tree actually I've, I already have the tree so they sent it, the tree to me twice and um, and I did that one in one night. I think I showed you guys that one. I did it in one night and I, um, I took it to work and I have it hanging up at work. So I think I'm gonna do the same with the little kitty cat. I'm gonna do it. It won't take me but a couple hours because it's all you do is you just drill the, the face and the, everything else is, is uh, partial, so. I'm going to try to do that one, I don't know, next few nights. And then I started the 
chrysanthemums and while I wait for my custom and every moment contacted me and I ordered the custom before the holiday because I wanted I wanted it and I didn't want to wait for the, the sale and for because I knew how many other people would be purchasing and everything well didn't matter so I ordered it a good week before the sale I got an email last night from Evermoment saying that they need 10 more days to properly print my canvas and get it out to me. So that means I'll be waiting another month to get that. So I was hoping that because I've already waited two weeks that we were close to it at least being in the mail, but no, not so lucky. So anyways, it's a bummer. So I'm probably gonna do the chrysanthemums and the little kitty cat one. another one in between because it won't be enough to hold me. Maybe I'll start on a square one to get me into the habit of doing square again because I've been doing the rounds now I finished my brotherhood from Diamond Art Club and I think I videoed I took a video of that. Oh, I put it on the on the Facebook group. A couple Facebook groups. But I'll maybe put it so you might be seeing it before you're seeing this. Maybe I'll put it after. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll put this one up first, then I'll put that one up. I mean, on the same video. So you'll be seeing it just later on in the same thing, you know. So I'll do that. Because it's just a short little showing you the, the end. And I did have little issue with my painting. I didn't complain or anything. Um, I haven't sealed it yet, so when I seal it, I might, I haven't cleaned it or sealed it or anything yet. So when I do that, I might look at it for really closely and see if I need to give them a call but I had there were a few drill colors that and not your typical it wasn't like 310 or anything it was like 154 I think 154 and like 336 or I think those are two of the ones that I had problems with but they looked like they there was too much material in the mold for the diamonds so they looked like they're the drills were taller than other drills and 
So they look like little, kind of like little miniature little cream puffs. So they were poofed out a little bit. And so they were kind of a little bit taller. So I don't know if that's going to make a difference when I'm all, when it's all done by going, you know, if, if it, if they stick out, then yeah, I'll call and have to redo all those. And, and then some of them had, you know, extra around the edges and I just threw those into the trash bucket and I didn't run out of diamonds or anything though. And then my 5200, there were, and I had tons of extra, so it didn't make a difference in the end, but I had to, it took a lot of work to pull them out, but they were almost like full round beads because, you know how sometimes they stick together, you know, the two, and the, and the two flat parts will stick together. Well, these were sealed together. So they were completely sealed together and looked like little round pills in there. And as I would shake them, and I have that one video of mine that I use those tweezer things and I get my needle nose tweezers. And I'll go in and tweeze, tweeze them and get them apart. Well, it didn't work on a majority of them. So I put them in an, in one of those, um, one of those little containers that I just showed you. And it filled up the trash. So how many of those there were, it filled up two of those fully to the top. And... So, yeah, you can, you know, and I mean, I, there was like 49,000 of them in that painting, you know, so I mean, there were tons of them in that, because that's a 64 by 52, um, and all that white in there was, you know, all the way around it, all the way around the, the lions were white, and. So, I mean, there was a lot of white in there. So, you know, and that one, it didn't make a difference because I didn't run out at the end. So, I'll just have to see if those other ones, um, if those other ones stand up. Because I really didn't want to have to wait for them to send more. If it doesn't ultimately matter, you know, it's fine. Uh, the canvas was beautiful. The the um, AB diamonds were gorgeous. It just makes it just pop. Um, you know, in the in the light, just makes it. It was just it really really pretty. And so overall, very very happy with it. And you do get what you pay for. very nice the glue very nice all that so I was very very happy with it and I do have one more of theirs to do that spot and it has the AB diamonds also so also that I videotaped over the weekend and I don't think I have that up there yet so that might be coming in in this video and on that one I that was from DIY Moon and I have I got one that was a kitty cat and then one which one did I get? So I got the kitty cat one for my sister. Hmm. Isn't that horrible? Can't even 
even remember what I purchased. Well, I know I got um, a little magnifying lens thing for my sister. And oh, there's a bus. I'm just sitting there. So, um, so I got that for her and she really likes it. It really, really shows, you know, if you can't see a symbol or whatever, it really, really shows their, shows it well. And I just love, I love them. Um, I love ordering from them. They, they do the. Their diamonds are always, I know they don't make their own diamonds or anything, and you know, they, um, but you get to watch them pack it, you know, and they do, they check the diamonds before they, they package them up, but, um, sometimes they're in like little baggies, and, and, um, they just always seem very clean, very, very clean diamonds. And they do all the specialty things, like they they'll do customs, um, electrify, and they do a lot of like the crystal ones and you know the rhinestone ones and stuff that. Um, and then like they'll do theirs, you know they'll do do it before they. Um, before they sell it and then they'll show it to you you know what it looks like completed and and uh, I just I, I just really really like that family and stuff so um, so I posted I wish I could remember what the other one was kitty cat I'll do that one. The one I bought for myself to do that I don't remember. I tell you. And I did get stuff off of AliExpress for the sale. I think I got another Ever moment I think I don't know can't even remember what I bought but when I I'll do a drill with me and we'll talk about that maybe so I bought a new thing for my phone to sit at that suction cup thing attaches to your windshield and then it goes has like a this I don't know this bendy cord thing and out and I thought it could be higher up so that you could kind of see me and then it could be over here a little where I could see the the camera better eyesight, you know, to go to the camera. And I did a little video this morning, <laughs> two minutes. I did it for two minutes this morning. No. Don't waste your money on one of those because it doesn't work for videoing. It might work for like GPS or something like that but it doesn't work for taking a video because it's loose and so it was bouncing around in the car over every bump every around every corner it was just I could have held it straighter if I was holding it with my hand so no I immediately
contractors have been at my house all week again and still haven't finished the job that I paid them to do and then today they wrecked doors wrecked doors they were supposed to fix the hinges make it so that it's um, you know adjust the opening and closing of the doors because some of the doors weren't weren't just right and so instead of doing what they needed to do on on to get them to get the whatever I don't know I don't know exactly what they did but they didn't do it right because they took a box cutter and just started hacking away and now granted I have they were natural three inch trim so I have three inch trim natural it was natural wood when they put it in and knotty pine natural doors and so when they put those in they were untreated and so my hundred thousand dollars that I paid to the contractor to do all the work in my whole remodel I paid an extra thirty eight hundred dollars to a woodworking guy to do the staining of the polyurethane of the three inch trim and the natural doors and um, so they just cut that all to shit basically and I hate that you're recording and then on your phone and your phone rings so what happens yeah your video goes away I don't like that very much now you're way up here and you see my only double chins you don't like it oh well so anyway so my doors are all cut to shit and not only did my doors get cut to shit but then they like skidded when they were doing the box cutter, skidded and went T -t 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 across the trim on a couple of the doors. And I don't know why they had to hack some, I mean, some of them they hacked the corner, you know, like the corner was here and they hacked it off so it's like a, like you would take a corner off a cake or something. I mean, just horrible, horrible, horrible. And they said they're going to fix it. They better not, they better replace them and get the stain guy out back out there. Because now, now that I got the stain guy that I used together with this company and now they're doing business together so you know I brought this guy all this business because I introduced him to the contractor so you know you think I get a piece of that no I did not so I pushed you guys back <laughs> oh, dear anyway okay well I have to run into this store right here and then I will I don't have anything else to say right now so I just will maybe do another one and uh, some stuff
stupid person was trying to pass me in the parking lot. Golly. Crazy, stupid drivers. This is why I take the bus. Because I don't like stupid drivers. Okay. Anyway, I will get in and at least record something signing off wise a little bit later. Talk to you later. Bye. Immediately, that's Jack in there. Thank you. Sir, the Mickey Spaniel business will work to you from here. Like I said, it's my off. And because of your relationship to the suspect, I'm offering you the opportunity to assist. And we're super duper grateful that you still want to come. Jack, is there a problem? No, there's not a problem. It's just Sarah's getting married this weekend, and okay, now is the best time for her to feel it. And here I thought you just didn't get the invitation. Uh, we can get you guys in. Can I get out the invitation? Hi, welcome to Cine Crafts. Today I have an unboxing. And from a different angle. I'm doing it from up there down here for my unboxing instead of side to side. So this is from DIY Moon. And vlog number, their vlog number 108 shows them packing this. Let's get this going. Take out the packing slip. There. And I hope this get, gets it in film and frame, but we will see. Boy, I sure do pack it pack it good and of course they send theirs through DHL so I ordered this last week sometime I wish I, I, I didn't write it down let's see when did I order it I ordered it on 11-9 and I got it today, and today's 11-12. Or maybe I ordered it on, I think they packed it and sent it on 11-9. And then today's 11-12, so. And it comes from the Philippines. So, yeah, it's fast. Okay, we got into the first layer. <laughs> it's like Christmas. And I've ordered six kits from them so far. And they um, look at that. Chocolate. <laughs> it was scooping out chocolate ice cream earlier. And it it's attractive. Okay. Um, I have done some of their kits. I did the blue butterfly and the purple dragonfly, and I loved them. So here's the box, and it's all in good. There's just a little, like, indentation there, but... good to me and as you order stuff from them they give you free things and they made a mistake um, they had it that I was a first-time customer instead of a repeat so next time I will get an extra something um, but I got a, a pouch and this is what you get the first time, but I already have mine, but I, I didn't have this sticker. This is a, um, diamond sticker and I 
And there's their information. I think I'm videoing it from that side so you can see. And then here's their stickers and they are clear. See with the diamond. So I have my book that I put them on. So that's that. And then I ordered this for my sister. See that? It goes around your, and then this is the magnifier for if you're not sure a certain spot. They have some that have covers on them, but I thought that was a cute little thing to, to get, so got that. And then here are the beads the drills for I got a whiskers and I got daisies and they don't have DMC coats on them oh this one does this one does uh, this packaging has the DMC codes written on them this one doesn't look like it does it's just numbered 1 through 14 so that's that and they give you the green trays and then a pretty good pair of tweezers and a couple of multi-placers and regulars. So now, the pictures, and these are both, okay, this one is a, um, this is a cat and I think it's a 20 by 30, I think is what I, what I got. Isn't that cute? So cute. So, so cute. And here's the picture of what it's supposed to look like. That like that. Gracie's getting yelled at in the back for... That's that one. Dewey, stop it. Okay. And then this one is daisies, and it's a 40 by 30. Oh, these are 30 by 40s, both of them. And then here's the daisy one. It has 14 colors. And this is the one that I have the, oh no, no DMC codes on this one, but DMC codes on the whiskers. So those are my two that I got today. And then let's take a look at that. And they come with really, really nice plastic baggies. And I always use, take this and put it on top of when I kit it up. So this is for the whiskers one, so this is for the cat. And they look really good. I've never had a problem with their drills. Their drills are always don't have a lot of, you know, overhang and aren't messy or tall or. So I've always had really good luck with them. 
and I don't remember how much I paid, but I will, I'll try to look that up and I'll put that on the video before I post it. Why don't I do that? So there's that one. And then here's the daisy one. And these are separate. But again, even though they're the different manufacturer for the drills, they're still really good. Oh. Ooh, I like that one. I like that color. A lot of pretty greens. Pretty, pretty. And I wonder, I mean, even look at this is, I think it probably is 310. I don't see any blue tint to it, so I don't think it's 939. I think it's 310, and they're all clean. Not much trash in there, it looks like. I mean, I've been very, very happy with... They check the drills before they package them up, and so really, really pretty. So that's it for today just a short little a short little video because I wanted to open it and get it take a look at it so I thought I'd better I better film or else it would never get filmed <laughs> and thank you for subscribing liking commenting and I will see you next time. Thanks everybody. Bye-bye.